Hey guys, Jamie Zero. How you doing? Oh, man, afternoon coffee break. <coughs> gonna answer a couple of questions. Um, it's gonna be a pretty quick one because I gotta get back after it. We got some uh, pretty good storms moving in uh, this evening. So my thoughts and prayers are with everybody through the Midwest. Hopefully we will all come through this all right. They're calling it some kind of derecho with some serious straight line winds. And uh, we've been use, using the better part of the morning to kind of batten down the hatches, so to speak. We took all of the, uh, our refrigerator has an ice maker on it. So we've been taking all the ice and putting it in uh, the zip top bags and storing it in the freezer. That way the ice machine will keep making more ice. That way if we lose our power for a few days, we have ice to help keep things cool. And Because uh, it is very, very hot today. It's about, I don't know, 683 degrees <laughs> out here. <coughs> and uh, we've got uh, as much, any empty container we can find, we've you know, filled it up with water. And uh, you know, folks are in and out of town. Uh, you know, getting some gas for the generators. Just trying to you know, do what we can to get ready. Uh, so we should be alright, we'll weather down the storm, uh, but uh, wish us luck, and uh, for some reason I don't uh, uh, you know, post anything for a few days or a week or whatever, it'd be because we've lost our power, and, and uh, you know, we're just without power and internet, so, anyway, uh, a couple of questions here real quick, um, Nicholas Bennett, uh, asked me a question about, you know, he's, he's heard and he's read that you're not really supposed to can on the glass top stoves. And I've, I've heard and I've read the same thing, um, but I have, that's all that I have. I have a glass top stove and uh, I use what I have. Uh, I haven't had any issues with the glass, you know, cracking or breaking. Not saying that it won't, uh, just saying that I have what I have and I use what I have. Um, if it ever does cause an issue, I will, you know, I'll let everybody know. But as of as of right now, you know, we've been canning for a couple of years on that glass top stove, uh, pressure cannon and water bath cannon, and I haven't had I haven't had personally haven't had any issues with it. Uh, I'm not saying that you know recommending anything that anybody do anything. I'm just saying here I have that glass top stove and that's what I use because that's what I have, and I've never had any trouble with it. So uh, take it for what it's worth. Uh, New Mexico Prepper asked me about the Preppers Talk live show. The, the Blog TV thing, I don't know what happened to it. It, uh, it Blog TV just kind of went away. I don't know if it's still there or what, but I know that they made some changes that weren't that weren't uh, good. Uh, so the blog, blog TV thing is out. That Preppers Talk live show is, uh, is no more uh, than I know of anyway. And uh, I think what we're going to do is uh, every couple of weeks or twice a month or so, I'll do a hangout on on my channel uh, like we did uh, what was it last week we'll do another one of those Google Hangout things on my channel broadcast it live and uh, have different folks come on with me whenever I do uh, one of those hangouts and we'll talk about different things I do believe that uh, Brad from the full spectrum survival channel is going to be uh, will be hanging out with me on the 18th which is a Wednesday you know, if everything goes well and if everybody has power and all that kind of stuff, I do believe that uh, it is going to be him. And uh, you know, he's got some. They got some. They got a really cool channel. And uh, so it'll be, it'll be uh, us hanging out on uh, Wednesday the 18th with the uh, Full Spectrum Survival and uh, talking about survival stuff and and uh, hanging out. But anyway, the uh, the Purple Talk Live is no more. And I've had at least four people send me uh, messages asking me why I don't put a, a PayPal donation link on my channel. Absolutely not. Never, ever, ever, never, never. Please stop asking me about putting a donation link. Uh, no, there's no way. I'm not, never, ever, never. Uh, I really appreciate you guys thinking, uh, you know, and wanting to help and stuff. But I'm not, I'm not, no, that's not what I'm about. I'm not about asking for help. I'm about, uh, you know, try to show people to do, I try to do what I can with what I have. And uh, there has been a lot of people who have, you know, have sent gifts and I really appreciate the gifts. And it's really awesome. It helps us out and it helps us get, you know, different gear and, and get set up better. But I'm not going to put a link. I'm not going to, I'll never put a link to where, you know, anybody can just go and, and, 
and do a PayPal or whatever. I'm not, never ever. So I'm out. I'm out on the whole asking for donations with a PayPal link. So stop asking me. <laughs> That's not, I'm not built that way. Uh, like I said, I appreciate you know you thinking and, and wanting to help, and I appreciate the people who have sent gifts in the past. Uh, but I'm not going to come out and ask. So anyway, uh, that's going to be it for now. I'm going to get back down. I'm going to uh, I'm going to tie a, put a rope over the top of the smoke shack. The smoke shack there is uh, is secured with T post and U bolts. Uh, but talking with a really really good and respected friend of mine, A Z Papa Les. Uh, if the wind gets underneath that tin, it could rip right through the U-bolt. So I'm going to just tie a rope over the top of it and anchor it down. Just a little bit of extra protection for the smoke shack uh, to keep it together. And uh, we're going to be, uh, uh, you know, getting ready for the storm to come through. So, like I say, everybody in the Midwest, my prayers and my thoughts are with you. And I pray that everybody makes it through the storm uh, alive and healthy and uh, intact. And uh, wish us luck. And uh, there you go. So. Y'all have a great day. Holy crap. That's good coffee. I'll put a link down below. I do not make any money, by the way. Uh, somebody asked if I get a little cut on the coffee. No, I do not. That's not the reason that I do it. I do it because it's really, really good coffee, and it's really, really, really good price on it, and uh, that's what I'm all about. So, anyway, guys, have a great day. Um, God bless. In the end. Buzz, buzz. The end.